What's your morale thing. like? It's great. Yeah. It's great. You know what I'm saying? Situations like this, you know, um, it only brings your team together. You know, uh, any team that fall apart really don't stand a chance. And that's the best thing about this team. You know, times like this, we come together. You know, we don't, we don't, we don't break apart. You know, so we, the camaraderie is great. You know, the vibes are great. The morale is great. Everything is great around here. When you look at, obviously, their offense, it's going to put a lot of stress on, on the back end with the way Drew likes to sling it around. What do you, how do you prepare for an offense that is that versatile? Oh, you just you prepare you like like every other week, you know. Um, you get in the lab, you put um, countless amount of hours in to, to prepare. You know, um, we know what this uh, offense has to uh, to offer. You know, we like you know that they like to score points, like to get the ball up the field, and um, that's what we preparing for this week. You know, that's the um, that's the mission this week. You know, to attack and and play violent, and that, that's where it's gonna start from. The over the top stuff. How are you? How are you guys trying to correct that? Sticking to our game plan. Sticking to our game plan, man. Um, you know what I'm saying? We, uh, nobody wants chunk plays, you know, but you know, we're going to stick to our game plan and get ready to, to go out there and, and get ready to stop some, some chunk plays. You say the morale is good, the vibe is good. Everything. Great. Every, all I just said, said great. Great. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Wes was saying that there's, there is not an ounce of quit in this group with Come the way on. you guys have quit. Not at all. Quit. Not at all. Not at all, man. The last five weeks didn't go the way we wanted to go. You know, it's the, it's the pros. You know, everybody wants to win week in, week out. You know, in the last five weeks, we've been able to get that done. But um, the, the energy is still high, you know. Um, we're, not, we're not losing games big. You know, we lose about one or two possessions, and uh, we understand that. That's why we stay together. That's why, because, you know, there's only one or two more plays, you know. Dante, how excited are you to face Drew Brees for the first time? Oh, very excited, very excited. Um, I'm a New Orleans guy, uh, knowing what he did for the city, you know, um, since he got there. Uh, I, was, I was young when he got there, 06 or something like that. Uh, he's just been just doing all great things for the city, you know, since he got there, and I'm excited to play against him. What makes him such a special quarterback? Um, just, you know, his poise, you know, really never seems to get rattled. Um, just his, his IQs are off the chart. Um, that, that's really the things that really stick out when you watch him on film. Yeah, he's play on Monday night. He had a juice. That's the only game in town. That's the only game on yeah. TV. This is your first one? Yeah, the first one. Um, exciting. Oh, very excited, very excited. Uh, can't, can't wait to get out there, you know, um, Monday night, uh, going against the home team, you know, probably – 80% of my family is still Saints fans, so it's gonna, that's going um, to be exciting. What do you do with the other 80% to convert them to your side? Huh? What do you do with the 80% to convert them to your side? Just win, baby. <laughs> How many ticket requests did you get this week? Oh, a few. <laughs> a few. Not a few in there. Did you grow up a Saints, a Saints fan? Yeah, of course. Of course I did. Have any Saints Panthers memories? Uh, nah, man. Come on now. He trying to turn my, my locker room against me. <laughs> I, don't have, I don't have no Saints memories now. Not a Saints fan no more. So no Saints memories. Is this gonna be a little surreal playing against a team that you grew up being a fan of and watching, and obviously any of the quarterback that you grew up watching? I mean, being that we playing them so late, uh, it's another game, man. It's another game to prepare for. Uh, uh, knowing the, the severity behind the game, you know, uh, playoff berth or not, um, that's obviously a, a thought of mine. But just going against the Saints, it, it's not a thought. You know, it's late in the season. Um, I didn't play 14 games. Uh, just ready to go play, man, Monday night.